Hello friends. In this video, I'm going to tell you how to enable Salesforce Lightning feature in your developer sandbox. I've asked this question many times during the interview sessions, but I have surprised with the answer that many of the developers doesn't know that they can actually go and enable Salesforce Lightning feature in their developer sandbox. So to explore Lightning functionality, we'll log into developer sandbox. And then you need to click on setup. So in setup, you will find option lightning experience. You just need to click on this lightning experience option. And this page will get open. Where you can actually watch videos on lightning experience. You can evaluate whether your org is ready for lightning experience or not. You can actually preview how your org will look like. You can compare what is limitation in Salesforce Lightning or what, what you can achieve in Lightning, but you cannot achieve in Classic. So that level of comparison, you can do it by just clicking this compare hyperlink. So here you, you will see that page will get open, but meantime, we'll see other things. So here you can see, you can set up domain, you can enable social accounts, notes. You can actually decide with, if you want to enable this feature for all the profile, or if you want to enable this uh, feature for limited set of profiles. So even if you enable this at org level, still you can control whether you want to achieve, uh, activate this uh, feature for any of specific set of profile or for all the profiles. Then here you will see, I have already enabled, but here you will see switch. Uh, if it is not enabled, then you, here you will see disable. And then you, you just need to switch it on and enable this feature lightning experience. So once you enable your lightning experience, and if you are in classic mode, then you just need to click on your name, uh, down arrow next to your name. And there you will find option switch to lightning experience. But before that, we'll just go through the lightning uh, limitations. So if you remember, I have told you that there, there is a link on this page compare between lightning and classic. So you must know what, what is there in the lightning, what you cannot achieve in lightning. So here you will see the complete list. We can take few example like for example item to approve you can add that section in on your home tab in classic view but you cannot add that component in lightning experience for example we'll take another uh, feature which we usually use in classic for example we usually find or merge our duplicate leads in classic view but that as of now you cannot achieve in lightning experience I'm sure this is a useful feature and Salesforce might have considered this and they'll try to consider in upcoming release. So here you can see complete list, what you can achieve, what you cannot achieve. Okay, so we'll go back to our developer sandbox. So I have already enabled this feature and I have told you how to switch between classic and lightning. So here you can see there is a link switch to lightning experience. If you click on this, then you will see this. This is what is the lightning view. This is my home tab. I can still go and customize home tab. Like we can do it in classic view. So here you can see recent records, today's tasks, upcoming event, my quarterly performance uh, report. This is my tab view. This is my list view. From here, I can switch between apps, call center, marketing, community, sales. If I want to go to app exchange product, I'll get button for app exchange product. So from here, I can switch between apps, app launcher. These are my tab. 
if I want to see all the tabs, then I just need to click more. So there is only case people. Here you can create You can see help and training. You'll get option to go to setup. This will be your notification window. And again, from here, you can switch between your username, which, which are saved in this particular browser. And you can switch to classic view as well. If you want to switch between link, uh, lightning and classic. So that's it for now. We are going to cover how to customize home tab in lightning experience, how to customize list view, how to customize UI using standard component in lightning view in our next video. Thanks for watching this.